Yeah, yeah, I feel like with Katarino, the NDA got lifted and everyone's just talking about all the shit. All the fuck, all the ticks. Dude, I have stuff, dude. Yeah, I was. Dude. With that, yeah, yeah, I, I never got invited to the Katarina closed beta test. <laughs> you need to my viewers for that. <laughs> so much drops, dude. Fuck. <laughs> Can provide some understanding. Here's why I care is because I, all the time that I was with Izzy, I had to deal with these stupid fucking comments of people accusing her of doing things and having intentions that she didn't have. And this made my relationship with her slightly worse. And I think it's something that's in the back of the mind of a lot of other content creators who are out there who are dating somebody else who's also a content creator. And the reason why people have that opinion and the reason why people think that and the reason why they're paranoid is because of people like this. These are the people, these are the reasons that I have the problems that I have with, with her. Wait, I'm That's confused. why. What are you saying? That people think his girlfriend is into fucking other people when she's not? But because people like Kate make people think that girls on Twitch are just leeching thoughts and using him for clout, because there are actually people that use people for clout. Thank you so much. Oh. Tommy Pancake, thank you for the five doc. I've been sent for- oh, I already read that. Thank you for that, six minutes ago. Call me CD, thank you for the five Says, Could you uh, welcome my friend Kate to the Champions Club? Come on, come, 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 come! You're up, soldier. Now go sort this fucker out. Oh. Nice shot. Aim assist, huh? Wait, I was gonna- Animal Crossing, I don't... I don't really want to do that. <laughs> Animal Crossing, I... He's so good. Cock and ball torture. From Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. I dodged that bullet chat. Hold on, where is it? I looked this one up the other time, the other day. I could have been part of the harem. <laughs> Cock and ball torture from Wicked. Anyone could have been part of the harem if they had a penis and over 400 viewers. Look at this. Oh, what my god. What? It's a game. Do you want to play? What do you do? What's just like? I have to punch, like. What the hell? <laughs> and there's a. We gotta attack Coomers. Look. <laughs> I love. It's actually I love. good. What? It's so cool, right? I keep playing. You're out of mana. Yeah, you gotta heal it. Okay. Jump. I lost. I lost. I lost. Oh shit, dude. Interesting. I heard, I, I did not know that. Oh, no, no, no. Did you guys know? I thought, I thought anyone else here did Caterino? Sorry, my god. I think, I think Joey does. Raise your hand, man. <laughs> <laughs>
I don't recognize any of them, so I'm asking now. Holy shit. Oh my god, dude. I, I heard- I, I did not know that. Oh god, god. Did you guys- But hey, coaster. Okay. Joker. Hey, Reddit detectives activated. <laughs> like you know like there's the there are obese and overweight especially like women like this is i mean i could be wrong statistically about this but my perception is that it's women who like want people to be like accepting of all body types so they'll post about like, you know, there's no such thing as fat and they'll be like overweight. And mm -hmm. it's usually women. At least social media has led me to believe that. Mm -hmm, and the mm -hmm, paper mm -hmm. that I looked at was looking predominantly at women. And the funny thing is that like people who, women who want men to accept them for being overweight and treat them the same as someone who's not overweight are not willing to date overweight men. So that's common. We're all like that. I think it's all ego. Like, you know, like, there's the... Is that even a take or is that just, I mean, that's just like factual. But yeah, true. I, I know that he's clever, he's smart, he's funny, I know that, but I don't know why I'm so attracted, but I, I met you in my dream uh, really? when you, you, when you first time you texted me. What? I I in my oh. dream. Look at this girl's face the whole time. But I don't know why I am so attracted. But I I met you in my dream. Uh, really? when you you mean you first time you texted me. What? I I met you in my oh. dream, and then since then I am attracted to you. Really? Did 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 he text you in your dream? No 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 no. I just dream about hey. him. Oh, really? Wow. Interesting. Wow, that's awesome. That is so cool. That is so cool. I dream about I like him, too. I that's pretty normal. Did like, she if you see somebody on stream enough, like, you start dreaming Doesn't about she, them. Is it, am I stupid, or does she kind of look like Noboru, except with, like, different colored, like, hair and eyes? Is it just where she's sitting? Interesting. Wow, that's awesome. That is so cool. Like that is nose. so cool. I dream about I feel like him that's too. That's pretty normal. Like if you see somebody on stream enough, like you start dreaming about them because I feel like I had dreams about like. Oh, I feel are like you that's dreaming normal. about him, Juice? I I know that he is clever. Fake dream. Is what it is. I'm a. Oh, okay. Did you guys know that I date Caterino? Oh my god! I, heard, I, I did not know that. Oh god, god. <laughs> did you guys know? I thought, I thought anyone he... else here date Caterino? Same shit. You called me things like Heffa, told me I sucked dick to get my college degree, repeatedly told me I was a low IQ, subjected me to a very patronizing valley girl impression, you called me white bitch over and over and over, and at one point said, I hate you, you white bitch. Your chat called me an inbred white C-word. You said that I was one hamburger away from being obese. 
And then you called me a KKK member. So let's get that out in the open, Tree. Because in this day and age, accusing someone, you called me things like Heffa, told me. Oof. Did you think that maybe you would be better if you were black? Yep. And being black is important because you'd have a bigger dick? And look better, but, but you know, taller. Yeah. So it would. So you don't have that advantage. Like this guy has the. I know it sounds. Why are you laughing? What's? Yeah, no, it's funny. It's funny. What's funny about it? Uh, uh, is Doctor K like loosening up uh, on stream. It's fucking weird to say, isn't it? Say it. Yeah, no, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's fucking it's, weird to say, man. Yeah. Right, we were both thinking about the dick size, right? Kind of makes me nervous. No. Nope. Oh, just me. I mean, then. I just so, play, just, yeah, no, we'll, I just think just about the, dick size when it comes to black men. Part of the package when you're. Uh... Did you think that maybe? Welcome. I I saw from the earlier shows that you produced this past year how successful relationships can be yes. that get cultivated on the show, and I decided to myself. <laughs> During the midst of this coronavirus pandemic, I am looking for a girlfriend. Yes. So what better place to find her? Yes. That has then the raw show that has cultivated such incredible relationships. That's right. We have. Yeah. He, he is correct. The raw show has led to some of the most successful relationships ever. Um, and I do say plural. Um, because yeah. we mean it. Oh, good one. And I felt like she was kind of weird. Okay. <laughs> okay. I felt like she was kind of weird. All right. Cause the, I felt she was flirty with everyone and I called her out on it. And she didn't like me about that. And I even told her in DM, I was like, I don't like how you, you're you like that. <laughs> but she even tried to <laughs> hang out with me too. <laughs> I don't want to leak DMs, but like. <laughs> Yeah, dude. That's. Uh, she went to Texas before I. Uh, before I. Before me and Matt were dating, and she's. That's the first time I've ever gotten upset about. Or that was the first time I ever had a problem, with anything. Was but like that, watching her on stream. Weird. Done. Although I didn't realize it at the time, um, I suffer from e. All right, I'm, I don't know what we're doing anymore. I'm bored. <clears throat> yeah, it was like when she like grabbed Mrs. Leg, and then when she made the joke about Mrs. People Frost wow. being on her face, I didn't really like that. Zach, thank you for the tier one. All right, let's play The Walking Dead. Bye.